What's up, y'all? We are here at Fort Pierce Inlet. The uh, wind is blowing 100 miles an hour. <laughs> There's no going offshore. We're giving hunting a break this week. But uh, I've got some spots marked. I've never fished the backwaters over here or the inlet. But it uh, doesn't look like we're going to be able to get offshore this weekend. So we're going to give it a try. So just in case we don't catch any fish, go ahead and hit that like and subscribe button. Get that over with. And then uh, we'll take y'all on this weekend on a fishing trip. Like I said, the wind is howling. It's going to be howling all week. We already had this plan set up. We weren't canceling. So it is what it is. We're going to make the best out of it. So come along. Let's see if we can catch some fish. We'll figure it out somewhere. Get on out there and hunt. Quit begging. Get out there and find your fish, big boy. All right, remember guys, <laughs> check your safety equipment. We're getting ready to take off. My fire extinguisher was expired, so we just went up to the bait store, bought a new one. That way when Officer Green Jeans pulls me over, which you know he's going to, and checks all my stuff, we'll be good to go. I found the Megalodon, y'all. <laughs> he's real, and I found him right here in Fort Pierce Inlet. <laughs> like I said, when we got here yesterday, the wind's blowing probably 80 now, but we're not going to be able to get out there offshore, so we're just going to stick inside the inlet, try for some snapper, grouper, or whatever. Try locking the spot lock up, try that, and if not, then we'll drift, see what goes on. They're gonna be putting in work. You try to go out in that stuff, I'm telling you. That boat too? <laughs> no, not that one. <laughs> These guys that keep going out there turning around. Got a, they got a lot of energy heading out that inlet, then it's like, nah, I don't think so. Turning around and coming right back in. <laughs> uh, get it, girl, get it. What, what happened? It's under a rock. Ah. She's claiming she got something. It's under a rock. <laughs> you gotta watch her though. You gotta keep your eyes out on her. Womp womp womp. Fault alarm. <laughs> what you got? <laughs> a giant pinfish. Oh, that's a grunt. That's a grunt. <laughs> All right, a little grunt. <laughs> <laughs> no, it ain't keeper size. What? Not today, it's not. Oh. That's a big one. You know that ain't okay. <laughs> Hold it up here. <laughs> Key West Grunt. <laughs> oh my God. Gray Snapper. <laughs> There you go. <laughs> fish on, fish on. <laughs> ah, another grunt. We're in the grunt hole, y'all. Whoa, 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 whoa. What, somebody trying to get some camera action? <laughs> What is it? What? Uh, that's seaweed. They're seeing stuff, y'all. Alright, guys. We're going to try this Jupiter rig. Got a 6-ounce weight pinned between a swivel, another swivel. Then you got your leader hook on the end. About a 18-inch leader it's called a jupiter rig we're gonna give that a shot we'll 
get some of this big bait out there see what goes on And we're going to send it down. Get it, girl. What you got? What you got? All right, don't let it get the rocks. Pump, pump real, pump, pump real. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Don't grab that line. You can't. Just let it run. Look, keep your rod up. There you go. Woo! It's running. Uh, and babe, that's all you can do. Just let it run. Then when it quits, then start reeling. She got something pulling out, right? <laughs> it ain't stopping. Look, ease up on your rod. Ease up on your rod. Pull it up or? Like this. Ease up on your rod. Huh? Oh, oh. Oh. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> Mine got hit by the trolling motor. Or, you still got yours? Cut all mine. Ah, I was watching hers, wasn't paying attention to mine. What was it doing? Huh? Ah, uh, reel your rods in. Or, what? I need to see the trauma. Ah. Let me see how much line you got. Or... Look, tighten your drag just a little. Look, to the left. Which way is it going? All right. Is it still taking line out? Your lines in. Real, real. Keep reeling. If it starts getting loose, reel your line in. 
You hear me? Yeah. Start reeling. You getting line back? Where's your line at? Keep reeling. You gotta keep your line tight. If it starts pulling drag, then quit reeling, okay? She got something on here, guys. We'll try it headed out that way. All right, keep reeling. Keep, t keep tension on it. Are you getting lined back? Uh, I said it starts running and Quit reel and let it pull the drag out. Do what? You can't stop reeling. Huh? All right, hold on, speed up a little bit. Reel. Still running or are you getting line back? Keep reeling, you can't stop. <laughs> now I know your arms hurt, but you can't give it slack. Do what? When it starts taking drag, just let it run. Stop, put it in neutral. Ah. That is off. Womp, womp, womp. Osprey got him a nice one. Our Jupiter rig got broke off, so now we're gonna to try to knock a rig, guys. It's got a six ounce lead with a six alt hook at the bottom. Just bouncing off the hook. We're gonna send it down.
Yeah. What is it? I don't know. Too rough for a helicopter, you know it's bad out there, guys. We gotta go find some calmer water. The inlet got four or five foot white caps inside the inlet here. Dude. Ah! No! 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 Yeah, we don't want none of them. What the heck is this, guys? <laughs> I don't even know what that is. Ah. Sorry, fella, you're the one that bit it. Ah. Bag at it. All right, guys. This right here is a leather jacket. And you do not want to get stung by it. It's uh, venomous, the spines poke you. So handle these with care. You don't want them sticking you. Get him, get him, get him, get him. Get him. Ah, no, 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 no. <laughs> negative, negative. Oh, negative Ghost Rider, not what we want. Let me see it. Mm. Getting harder out here, guys. <laughs> There's the other one you don't want to get stung by, poked by. They call it stung, but actually it's just getting poked by this fin or this fin right here. They have the same thing. Got a little toxin that stings. No bueno. <laughs> no good. So saltwater catfish be careful when handling those also now he's gone yeah, get, get okay. another one yeah, another grunt back in the grunt hole you still ain't got a bite up here oh, are you serious are you serious right now that's why I pulled up with it. I said that was a good bite. <laughs> it pulled it under the rocks too. Really? Are you kidding me right now? That was exactly where I got when I said that's a good bite. That was a good This is bite. how bad it is, guys. When I tell you the struggle is real, the, str <laughs> the struggle is real. Even if I hold it up here, does it look real big? That's what size it is. And he pulled it under the rocks. Woo! Believe me, this is not the day we'll be fishing. Come on, guy. I'm not a kidding. It, it pulled it under the rocks. Oh. <sighs> All right, back out there. It's bad out here, guys. Probably can't see the waves for the GoPro, but got white caps right there at the inlet. Five to six foot white caps right there at the inlet. I think the wind's 24 miles an hour with gusts of 30. All right, guys, we put our trap out about a half a mile back. The currents done took it over the night, drug it up here, and no pinfish. We got some puffer fish. What we got? What we got? Let these guys go. Damn, damn, damn.
A little puffer fish. Yeah. Bag in order. Not gonna blow up for us. Camera shy, guys. They're not gonna puff up. Uh, and the third one. Not gonna show off for the camera. No pinfish. Even the bait fish aren't biting. But they get our trap back. That's a good thing. Somebody having a whole lot more rough day fishing than we are. Well, he's trying to have a picnic. Things went wrong. Yeah. Just when you think the fishing's bad, that could always happen. That's a pretty island. Get it? What is it? Haha, <laughs> a little grouper? Ah. I don't know. Nah, it's, that ain't big enough. Ah. That, no, that was in the channel. Right there in the channel. What is it? That one I threw out right there in the channel. Hold it up. little grouper. He's not big enough, huh? Gotta be 24 inches. Pretty little grouper. Let him go. I got your picture. Huh? We got a fish on, fish on. Ah, <laughs> another grouper. Come on, guys. Oh, those are pretty, honey. Unfortunately, not big enough. Hold them in front of the camera, make them look real big. Whoa, look at that one. It's a monster. Uh, gag grouper not in season anyway. Closed season. Uh, Alright. Got it? Alright. Get out of here. Ah! And he splashed me. Oh. Got a school of stingrays. I don't know if the camera going to pick it up. Out there. Oh, it's on, it's on. Oh yeah, we got. It's gonna be a shark. <laughs> First fish out of the inlet. Ah, wah, wah, wah. Single catch fish. That's your best one all week, yeah. <laughs> best one all week. <laughs> hey, at least they're getting bigger. Mm mm mm. All right, we're gonna throw that one back. Finally, finally, get it, get it, girl, get it, get it, get it. Get it. What do we? Oh, get it. Ah, mango snapper. All right. Ow! <laughs> Oh, he bit me. <laughs> Mango snapper, guys.
No, we're not keeping it neither. <laughs> huh? I know what you're thinking. You want to measure it, but no. Measure it, see if it's legal. <laughs> and then turn it loose. No, it's not. What? She just wants to. That way you can say you call a legal one. Let me see that device. They gotta be 10 inches. 10 inches, guys. That's a neat little measure here. Dump it in there. Dump it in head first. Oh, nine inches. Not legal. Back in the water. Boom. There we go. Oh, he got one that's legal. Oh. Dang on. Well, yeah. <laughs> we'll get over here. That ain't even a fish. That's bait, ain't it? Oh, that's that's big sand perch or something. Let's see what they got. What you got? What you got? What is it? Some kind of, I think, I think it's called sand. It, I'm not sure. I think it's called a sand perch. I'm not sure. That's a fish. Google it. Let her Google picture it. The bite's turning on, guys. <laughs> the wind's down to about, what, 15? 15 or 16 miles an hour. We did seek shelter. We did get out of the wind a little bit here. Really? Yeah, you get kid. What do you got? Another one? No, that's a little dinkers. Uh, a little lane snapper. A little baby lane snapper guy pretty fish all right yeah those have to be 10 or 12. ah dropped him on his head it's a runner it's a track it's a runner it's a track star that's <laughs> <laughs> oh, now she got another, another mangrove. Okay. That's a keeper. One. That's a bigger one. I don't know if we're keeping it, but it's bigger. It might be legal. So far, this is the only. Well, this thing is working. Like what? The jig head on the. You want another hook like that? Huh? This thing is working. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Stick. Better than Mangrove snapper, guys. Air put it in there. That one's 11. 11 incher. That's a legal one. Uh, anybody want it? Or no. You want it? Yes or no? No. Oh, wait a minute. Love it. Might catch a couple might, more. Yeah, we might catch some more. All right. Lisa, All right, Mike, make a sandwich out of that one, guys. Put it in the cooler up there. It's small, but it'll still make a sandwich, guys. And that's how rough it is out here today. <laughs> but it is starting to pick up a little bit. Little puffer fish, yellow eyed puffer fish, pretty little body. All right, back in the water. Yo, quick. They look slow, but they're not slow when they're chasing that bait. Huh? And that's a full day, full day, y'all. All right, guys, that's going to bring this one to an end. Uh, leaving the Dockside Inn and Resort, Fort Pierce, Florida. Real nice place to stay. Real nice dock, boat ramp. Only a few hundred yards away from the inlet, even though the inlet was uh, terrible this weekend. Five, six foot breakers right there at the mouth. So we couldn't get offshore to get to our spots. So we stayed inshore playing around. Just tried to make something happen. Uh, finally found some fish last night that we could get on. 
some snapper, a couple keeper snapper, small grouper. I uh, got broke off on some snook. Uh, just didn't get it on film because it was too dark. But nevertheless, still a good time. If you want to see some fish being caught, go back a few videos back to where we were down in the Keys, catching the mahi-mahi and blackfin tuna. That's some good ones. Uh, but nevertheless, if you like this kind of content, consider hitting that like and subscribe button and uh, we'll keep bringing them to you. So we'll see you on the next one.